Hey guys, Brian delivers you the goods here. I'm returning to you pretty late tonight for a track review. I kind of want to try to get this review out to you guys so you have something to enjoy um, for this Friday's new music. So this is for um, the new Bad Wolves track, uh, Die About It, their next single, I guess, that I'm going to be talking about in this review. So I'm going to discuss what I listened to for... Uh, Bad Wolves' newest single, Die About It. I think this is the third single. And let you know my thoughts on uh, <laughs> Bad Wolves' new song, Die About It. Sorry, my throat got a little scratchy for a moment. Had a little hiccup scratch or whatever the fuck it was. I don't know. So let's dive into this uh, track review. Now, basically, Daniel uh, DL's, uh, Daniel's vocals in this when it starts off with the set yourself free thing, that's where I'm liking it. But I'm gonna be honest, this song was a mixture of hit or miss. This, I don't know, I just wasn't feeling for this track that much. Like, Daniel's rapping in this track? DL is rapping? Really? I mean, yeah, it's fine to experiment and all, but this... Is not a good experimentation. This is where I have a problem with this new song. I want to like it, but I'm left with disappointment at the end of the day. I just, the rapping for the first two verses are god awful, and the way he's screaming instead of the bleh, which personally for me, Tommy Vex was fine. Um, with this band. I think Tommy Vex was making the band very successful. I know there was a lot of backlash at the time, and I'm glad there he apologized and all that, and hopefully things work out, and they are just being friends and casual friends and all that, even though they're putting their own political differences aside. It's all that matters at the end of the day. Like, if you really want to make up with some band and all that, and want to, uh, I don't know, it's in the future if it happens, like, uh, if Tommy Vex goes back to Bad Wolves, which, that would be awesome, but, I don't know if that's gonna happen. Personally, DL's with the band now, he's the lead singer, and this is where this band is slop, kinda acting a little sloppy now. And I just think instrumentally it sounds good, this track. But personally for me, this is where I have a problem with the track because of the rapping. This song, I'm really disappointed with this track at the end of the day. So overall, in my opinion, I think Die About It, the title track for the new uh, Bad Wolves uh, song that is going to be on their new album, Die About It, November 3rd is when the album's coming out, so it's coming out soon. Not too long, but it'll be coming out pretty soon, so. Yeah, I'm gonna give Die About It a 2.5 out of 5. I was really disappointed with this track. I just was hoping for something interesting with this song, and I, I mean, the screams were okay, but, and the clean vocals from Daniel sounded really good, my biggest gripe with the track that really ruined the track for me was the rapping. Didn't work for me. I was not on board with it. So pretty much, yeah. 2.5 out of 5 for uh, Bad Wolves Die About It. I, I wish I could give it like a 3 out of 5. I just, I had problems. I have my own personal problems with this track with how it sounds and all that. It just... It's not a very well-mixed track. So, with that being said, guys, um, still, I hope Bad Wolves pulls off a good album. Who knows? We'll just wait and see come November 3rd. Uh, but for now, this is probably the worst single they've dropped. Um, so, thank you guys for watching this track review tonight.